down, down. One door. Doors closing. Doors, doors closing. Here we go. Imagine the series intro is six minutes. I know, right? Netflix, do you want to skip intro? Yes! All right. Let's do it. Well, I was not ready for all that. This separates the boys from the men. This is triumphant, bro. Okay, hold on. One more time. Love the beginning. Just comes in with a super harsh crash symbol. You know, with these like, these uh, you know what I like to call them? Tycos! They're called Tycos! These! Tycos! I'm not gonna call them cinematic drums anymore. They're called Tycos. Then you have this blend of the brass section. And I hear like the beginning, you know, tip of those sounds, like the really accented brass sounds, but they're kind of quiet. The, the loudest thing is definitely the choir, you know, singing the ha, 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 ha. There's strings in there too. So all those things all together. And then there's low brass too, doing the like for the low undertones of it. So it's kind of like the layers that are being made up here. And now we got um some kind of bell instrument going on here, just kind of playing along with these drums. So let's, uh, let's see. Oh, getting a little bit more electronic. Mm. Ooh, I love that chord choice. It's starting to sound like positive. Oh. keeps teasing you. It comes in for like a few measures and then just goes away. So I wonder when you're watching the actual show, if it like starts off with like that triumphant part with all those instruments layered up on each other doing those beautiful chords and then it goes and I wonder if it like fades off into the actual episode during that part. That's kind of what I'm what, what I imagine would happen. Interesting. This part is just way more rapid than the, the big part. Bro, these strings, they're telling a story. I love how it didn't sneak up on you. This composition is not afraid to just make you jump, like give you a jump scare to really make those epic parts come in strong. They had the strings going on with still the bells and you know, the brass section in the background was being played really quiet. They, they sounded really calm in the background, but then everything is accented. Everything is forte. Everything is just hard and harsh in your face at the drop of a hat. They didn't like sneak in a little extra trumpet here or like a tease at a choir. They just said, nah, this is it. Life could change quick. Oh, okay. Mm, this brass section in the background. The strings are doing their thing, they're moving along, but the brass in the background is like. Wah, wah. Ooh. That's a different mallet instrument now. 
Mm, the low strings are being introduced. Actually, I think they were there. I think they were blended with the brass. These symbols aren't shy, bro. Keeps tricking me. Who are you? How'd you get in my house? The bend of the synth! This is a journey. Bro, that synth is crazy. Started off low octave, now it's higher. I can't do it, it's too high. It's, it's too high, it's too high. I don't, I don't get that high. Sounds so disoriented now. I like it. And those drums have not stopped the whole time. Mm. Electric guitars? M meshing with the choirs? And it's funny because this female vocal has like this lead vocal, but it's going along, well not going along with, but it's over the top of these choirs harmonizing in the background. And I think that just causes a nice dynamic when there's like two different type of vocal elements or different type of vocal elements going on in the song. It makes it sound chaotic, which is definitely I think what they're going for, especially with that damn synth that was mm -hmm. like it sounded like, like what the hell was going on there? You know what I mean? Like this, this is meant to sound like chaos. Did she just sing along with the synth bending? Sound like she went Ooh. Like it sounded like she did that really quick. I'm surprised I was able to hit that note. I don't know. She got a little got a little range. She got a little range. Oh perfect. Mm, the strings. Da, 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 da. Bro, that build up. I was not expecting the song to explode with an all out drum beat. And then her vocals, she was just teasing you for a little bit. And then she comes in with this long, sustained, powerful, dynamic note. I don't even know what the hell is going on. I, when I heard that, when I heard her voice do that and the drums come in at the same time, I kind of just lost it. I lost my mind. I lost my headphones too, but now we, we got them back. So we can't be stopped. Wow. Sound beautiful, girl. God damn. Got 
Is this a reprise of the melody from the beginning that the strings were doing? Get the f get out get out of my house. I don't know you. Why are you here? Who gave you a key? Oh! Na, 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 na. Oh! Stop it! Stop it! Big times to end it. I never thought a song like that with the way it started would just end with like some traditional drum set toms with a bunch of reverb on it. Wow. That was fire. <laughs> that took you on a journey. You know, I gotta I gotta stop being such a, a pessimist, you know what I mean? Like I, I see it's six minutes long and I'm like, I do an eye roll, you know what I mean? But there was no dull moments in that whole thing. No dull moments whatsoever. I enjoyed that. What more? What more? What more? I think they spoke too soon. Hey, now I'm about to kill that beat. Yeah, yeah. Too soon. Too soon. Uh, I know that they feel that heat. Yeah, yeah. Too soon. Too soon. Yeah. I think a hundred mil I reach. I deal with myself, only deal I need. Heard a lot of people trying to discount me, but they don't know, they don't know a thing about me. What?